Hey YouTube, Picot 58 here. I showed you guys yesterday I ended up getting a new lower, so I ended up going online and ordering one small thing for the gun since I, I figured that uh, I'm going to start from scratch. I'm going to get a couple parts, but I'm going to start slow. I'm not going to go nuts. I'm not going to speed this up and go crazy. But I ended up ordering, once again, from 556 Tactical. Came in today. Nice little package. It's actually boxed up for somebody else and they changed the name, but all my stuff is in here. So, what I ordered, you guys have seen it before. Ordered the Striker Compensator. Right there, you guys seen this before. You saw it on the other project on the Wyndham Weaponry one. The one I actually gave to uh, my best friend, Super Duty 696. Pretty badass, right? So, uh, the only, you know, the only one thing is, when I opened it up, I had a small hole in here. There's no crush washer. And the reason, one of the reasons why I ordered it real quick was because on the website, they only had one listed. I mean, a couple weeks ago, they had like seven. Well, not a couple weeks. So probably like, like maybe, yeah, a couple, like two weeks ago. They had about seven or eight of them. And I went on there the other, about four days ago, and it said one. So I said, you know what, let me order this just so I have it because we actually shot that AR, that Wyndham Weaponry. Uh, AR that we ended up doing for Super Duty that we gave away. I shot that over the weekend and that thing is extremely loud. It, it, it's awesome. So I said, you know what, I need one. I liked it so I'm, we're going to put it on the new one. But I also I am getting a another uh, 5.56 Tactical Assault Life sticker. Nice decal. I already actually have one hanging up so I'll, I'll do something that maybe give it a tadpole or lucky sprink. The other thing I ended up getting, if I can get them out of the box, right here, let's see, I got a couple, couple stickers from, I guess it's South Park Team America movie, it says Durka Durka motherfucker, so I thought they were pretty funny, it shows a little, you know, Taliban, it looks like Osama Bin Laden, American flag, it's got the, you know, crosshairs from a sniper rifle so I got a couple I'm gonna hand them out for the guys but one of the things uh, they actually gave me it's got a it's a patch same thing it's the same patch that matches actually matches the decal you know pretty close but what's cool about this patch is same thing Dirk the Dirk motherfucker and it has uh, on the back of it it's got velcro so I guess if you have something you could stick it to if you have a shoulder you know something with velcro you got a patch to go with it, so pretty cool. I didn't order it, they threw it in there. That's, you know, quite nice of them. The other thing I ended up getting is, you know, you got to have them whenever you order something. Let's see if it fits, you know. I'm not a small guy, but I ain't the biggest guy, but... I ended up getting a 5.56 Tactical shirt. Now, let me back this up so you guys can see. Let me see, pull back, pull back. There we go. Camera's a little up close, but 5.56 Tactical shirt. So, nice and black. You, I think it had black and gray. So, nice and simple. Wasn't too expensive. Nice little logo on the back. 5.56 five, five, Tactical with the wings, the skull. It's got the biohazard on it. You know the website. Basically plain tea, but something I said, you know, let me wear this. Their product's good. I like it. So, I got it for my collection. You know, it would be nice getting, uh, you know, the Armory Channel, like another shirt. I mean, I got one. I had a big bar on steel to get that one. But it'd be nice to get another one, and you know, it's not like Ebo and me make shirts, you know, because you know I'd wear that. But you but, there you guys go. Well, let me wait out. So you got some stickers, got a patch, you know, sticker shirt, and a nice new muzzle brake. I know it matches the other one, but I don't own a rifle that's got one. I gave that one away. So so if you guys got any ideas for my new AR, the one I'm building from scratch, let me know, guys. It'd be cool for uh, some input on it, alright? Thanks for watching, guys.